is Square POS one of the best in the industry or what? I mean, in today's conversation, I really want to answer that question. I want to go back uh, to look at the features, the pros and cons, the pricing and everything. So if you love this, uh, if you are thinking about uh, Square POS, I want you to watch this show till the end because I'll be providing a lot of gems. And uh, so here's an overview I really want you to pay attention to. So when you think about Square, I want you to think about uh, a payment processing and point of sale platform used by businesses of all sizes from brand new startups to large multi-store operations. So this is this is really fantastic. You have a constellation of, uh, of options here. And the thing here is that you have to think about the fact that Square does offer a an affordable fee structure for small businesses and startups, and which is a nice perk for those whose uh, turnover varies from month to month. And what we love about uh, this POS is that it's very user-friendly. Fantastic. Square has done a great job in uh, designing their POS. It's just fantastic. But hey, listen, Nothing, is, nothing humanly made is not always perfect, right? So let's quickly go through the pros and cons so you have a clear idea what you're getting yourself into if you were to go with Square POS. So here are the pros. It's, you have a, it's free to start, no monthly fees in basic plan, wide range of hardware to choose from. You have a free forever plan that is available. It includes a free card reader. It, you can receive better processing fee uh, rates with a high volume of transactions. And it's very customizable with numerous add-ons available. What about the cons? The account can freeze due to irregular activity, not cost-effective for high-volume transactions, no phone support, potential payment delays, and the processing fees could cut into profits. So here, are th those are those are things I want you to those are things I want you to think about. Now, boss, welcome back to the show. It's really a wonderful pleasure to have you here, to have a quick convo with you about Square POS. And when you think about Square, I want you to think about a, a tool that is great for businesses on a budget. So that's what we love. We love the flexibility. We love uh, the efficiency. We love the adaptability. So whether you are an established business or a new business, a new business, try to test the waters, not a problem. And Square does not, it's not just for the restaurant industry because we hear a lot, a lot of our customers, a lot of our own business customers, a lot of our viewers are asking, is Square only for restaurants? No, Square is not like, it's, it's not like a touch bistro or toast. Square is more, is more than that. You, it's way more than that. So you can use it for a lot of things. You can use it for, depending on your industry, not a problem at all. Let me talk to you about the added value because so i really want you to really have a clear idea so square is really really popular among small and mid-sized businesses because it has no monthly fees for the basic plan and a, and a flat transaction fee structure so this can make it ideal for brand new businesses that want a solid pos platform without spending much up front this is really great so by the way, boss, I want to quickly remind you of today's topic. We are having a conversation about Square POS review. I'm giving you a granular review so you have a clear idea what, you, what you're getting yourself into before choosing. And so when we talk about Square POS, and I really want to pay attention to the, the core services. So Square services come in four flavors, which lets businesses set up payment systems for both static and dynamic systems. So I want you to think about that this quartet, only four. So if you were, if you want to go with the Square, you have four strategies here so you have the square pos the square you have square appointments you have square for restaurants and you have square for retail so you have those four so square pos is a free it's free forever regardless of the hardware you choose it also comes with a free square reader for max tribe device then you have square appointments which is a very important module okay and the square appointments is, is free for individuals fifty dollars per month for businesses with two to five employees and ninety dollars per month for those with six to ten employees and then you have Square for Restaurants. So Square for Restaurants offers uh, a free version that supports unlimited devices and locations. Being a restaurant-specific POS software, among many things, it lets you manage end-to-end -end restaurant operations from table management, course management, and discount to inventory management and reporting. It has three plans, free, plus, and premium. And the plans, the paid plans start around $60 to $75 for each location. And transaction fees are 2.6% plus 10 cents for in-person payments and 2.9% plus 30 cents for online payments. And then you have Square for Retail. So like the restaurant software, Square for Retail has a robust free version. So this app manages a wide variety of retail uh, functions like vendor and purchase and purchase management. We also love the inventory management also. Like the restaurant platform, it has three plans. You have free, plus, and premium. 
peak tiers starts at around $60 to $75 per month for the first establishment and $40 to $60 for the subsequent locations. So transaction fees are 2.5% plus 10 cents for in-person payments and 2.9% plus 30 cents for online payments. So here you have it. So you have Square POS, Square Appointments, Square for Restaurants, which is the uh, in the uh, restaurant specific I, th I think I, I would say offer from Square. So Square for Restaurants competes directly with Touch Bistro competes directly with uh, Toast, among others, competes directly with uh, with Lightspeed POS, and then you have the score for retail. Let me give you the extras here. So when you think about score POS, you have a, a constellation of extras. So score the score app marketplace offers multiple third-party integrations. So these apps are really important, especially if you are, let's say, if you are an industry or you are in a niche where you need to have those integrations, you need to have those plugins. This apps come at different costs depending on what you need. Additionally, Square also provides add-on features at the extra cost. So for invoicing, this will cost you 2.9% plus 30 cents per payment. Loyalty starts at around $45 per location per month. So this is more like a geography based uh, solution for marketing starts at around $15 per month for up to 500 customers for payroll costs will be around $5 per month per contractor and $29 per plus $5 per month per employee. Then you have team management. You have the free basic plan, but the plus plan will cost you $35 per location per month. So you can see this square. I mean, square is cheap. Don't get me wrong. So no upfront, no significant upfront investment. However, if you want to use, if you really want to take advantage and really, uh, you know, get more juice out of this uh, Square Square POS, you really need to uh, have some add-ons. So that's where Square makes money. I mean, that's why they actually do a lot of uh, upselling and cross-selling. So, but overall, it's really a win-win for clients and and Square in our view because uh, they are adding value. So if you're adding value, you should you should you you deserve to to charge for it. And so one thing I want to say here is that due to a flat transaction fee system and an end of day reconciliation with Square is very easy, very, very easy. In fact, Square makes it easier by letting you decide your end of day preferences. The major pull of Square payment processing is that they do have a flat transaction fee system, but it can quickly become expensive if your transaction volume scales up. So if you find costs getting high, you can get it. You can get in touch with the company and work out a customized plan that works best for you. And this is what we really recommend to our many, many, many business clients, but also our viewers in general. You really want to, uh, you want to, you want to have a conversation. Have a conversation with uh, with Square so they take care of you. Square also has a list of prohibited goods and services. If you offer any of them, your account will be will be frozen without notice because it is included in its terms and conditions. So please read the fine prints before you actually uh, decide anything. Let's talk about the rivals. So you really have a clear idea, boss. I want to quickly remind you of today's topic. What are we having a conversation here? We are talking about Square POS. I'm giving you uh, an in-depth review of this tool so you have a clear idea what you're getting yourself into before buying. So when we talk about Square, you Square is uh, actually competing head-on with uh, Shopify, with Vend by Lightspeed, with a Touch Bistro. They also have a Toast and, uh, and and what have you. In terms of uh, the monthly fees starting price, there's none. There are none with Square. With Shopify, you do have, you have $29 to $30 per month. For Venn by last speed, you have a $99. So this is really uh, very expensive. Now, Square does not offer 24 seven phone support. They don't have it at all. Whereas Shopify and Venn by last speed do have it. Hardware is included. Okay, and the lowest transaction fee is like 2.5% plus 10 cents. So one thing I want to say here is that before you choose a score, you should have a clear idea of what its com competitors offer. And uh, so when compared to Shopify and Vend by last speed, Square is the only one with the zero monthly fees and the basic hardware included. And uh, the downside is that it doesn't provide 24 seven phone support, but Shopify and Vend fare better than Square in this regard. And Vend is unique in the sense that they charge a monthly fee but they do not have transaction fees. And uh, so this is what it is. So it is it is just something you have to really strike a balance here, what really works for you. And in, in our view, it's one of those things you gotta ask yourself, do you really need to have like an all-in-one tool or are you comfortable with having something uh, that is, uh, I would say granular or fragmented? And one thing I wanna say here is that Square does remain 
the Square does remain a very comprehensive tool. And when we talk about the POS, we also need to, to talk about the terminal itself, the T2. It's called the T2 Square Terminal. So Square Terminal is an all-in-one tool that allows business owners to process credit card transactions and print receipts. And the T2 is really great in terms of uh, what they offer versus what the competition is offering, okay? And the T2, the Square Terminal, consists of a single piece of hardware and Android software that includes a payment system and a paper printer. And at present, the Square Terminal T2 accepts traditional magnetic strip cards, NFC cards, EMV chip cards, Apple Pay, Google Pay, and Samsung Pay. So while many Square Terminal T2 owners use their device in a fixed location, the hardware is Wi-Fi enabled and can be operated without a cord by using an internal battery. So this is kind of cool, okay? And it's important to know that Square Terminal's features are not nearly as advanced as what you would, would find with the Square Point of Sale. Okay, so this is what it is. So you do have the terminal and then you have the point of sale. Let me talk to you about the pricing. And I want you to look right now on the screen. So here is a first screenshot. And here is a second screenshot. So one thing, one thing I really want you to think about before choosing Square, please, 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 please think about payment processing because payment processing can be a big headache for businesses because there are multiple fees levied by card companies, banks, and compliance standards. And Square's platform handles all of this for you and only requires you to pay them a few cents for each transaction. So for each transaction. So you have card present payments. You have a keyed payments. You you have, uh, so let me first talk to you about the card present payments. So you pay 2.6% plus 10 cents per transaction for card payments accepted using a Square Reader, Register, Stand, Terminal, Retail Plus, or a Square for Restaurants. What about keyed payments? If you key in the card details manually or from a file, you pay a transaction fee of 3.5% plus 15 cents per transaction. For a purchase done through e-commerce API, Square Online Store, Square Online Checkout, or Online Invoicing, you pay 2.9% plus 30 cents per cards or 1% with a minimum of $1 per transaction for ACH bank transfers via invoices only. So what about the hardware and software? Now, Square does provide multiple hardware options for its service. The software for all of them is free. In many cases, you can download from a Google, Pay, Google Play Store and Apple App Store. The, the software itself, the, in terms of updates, they're also pushed via the app stores. Okay. So you have the Square Reader for for Max Drive. So when you sign up for a Square, you get a free Max Drive Reader, which is great, which is great enough to get you started. It comes handy when you are, let's say, if you are on the go and need to accept, accept payments, you will love that. Additional Square Reader for Max Drive costs about ten dollars each, and so you have also the Square Reader for contactless chip. You also have the Square Stand for contactless and chip. You have the Square Terminal that I just spoke about, the T2. You have the Square Register. So you have a constellation of uh, of hardware and software. I mean, the hardware that will cost you, it really depends on your operations. It depends on what you are trying to, what, like, it depends on the kind of service you're trying to offer. Let me talk to you about the features. So when you think about the Square POS, what are the features you really want to pay attention to? Like where does Square really shine? Where does Square really add value to your business? Like big time, big time. And it's not just like adding value like uh, in the primary or ancillary operations, but really like on a holistic basis, on, a, on an overall basis. So with Squ with Square, you, Square POS, you can process, swipe, chip, and contactless payments. You can create items within the Square Terminal system, the T2. There are no hidden fees or charges. You can print receipts. You have flat rates for credit card processing. You have an easy to use interface. Easy to use is really important for us because when we, when we analyze POS systems, we always pay attention to the UI and the UX. Because otherwise, like, what if a tool is so great, but your staff can, can't, like, you can't use it, you cannot use it, or, or your staff cannot use it, especially in the, uh, let's say, in the uh, restaurant industry or, or whatever operation where you need to heavily to you need to stay on top of things if you have a system that your staff cannot use it's not really worth it so easy to use interfaces is fantastic with square you have a slick design 
with uh, we have sleek design with a modern appearance it's wi-fi capable so we love the wi-fi capability here you have multiple terminals can be connected to a single cache drawer it's compatible with ethernet internet connections you can add a hub for a square terminal that will cost you about 39 to 50 dollars a month you have financing options you have 24 7 phone support and you have 24 7 fraud pre prevention so overall one thing i want to say here is that you only just you just need to think about what really works for you okay and uh you also need to think about the hardware aspect of things so when we talk about the features please pay attention to the the hardware aspect of things because there is a difference between square terminal and square register so if you are comparing square terminal versus square register or even square stand you will quickly discover that the square terminal is a cross between a mobile credit card reader and a pos system with a built-in printer the terminal is a wireless all-in-one device where you can accept payments anywhere anywhere you have a wi-fi connection and the square register is a fully integrated pos solution with hardware that turns your ipad into a complete counter-based pos system so this is really like you know it's, it's one of those things you really need to have a clear idea like to sort of uh, have a clear distinction of what you're getting yourself into let me give you the verdict verdict here so if you were to ask us is score right for you or your business our answer is uh yes definitely definitely now it had it depends on uh it depends on your specific situation though if you are just starting out let's say you don't know how much your business will bring in Square is the perfect choice for you for you because it has zero monthly fees with a square reader for max drives thrown in. Enough to get you started right away. Right away. I mean, you know, no, no time wasted. If your transaction volume is low or fluctuates from one month to the next, Square can be a great fit because it ensures that you pay processing charges only for what you earn. The lack of a, a monthly fee makes it one of the more flexible POS platforms available. So this is kind of cool. And uh, but again, if your transaction volume goes up, this the, your cost can, can add up real quick. So this is where you have to call Square and really negotiate or renegotiate another, I would say another volume uh, volume discount with them. I mean, they'll take care of you though. I mean, they're very flexible because they want your business anyway. So they'll they, so they'll talk to you. And Square does support multiple third-party integrations via its Square app marketplace. So if you are someone who needs to have those uh, third-party uh, market third-party apps, you will love Square. You might have to you might have to pay for those integrations separately though, depending on which apps you choose. So this is something you really need to think about. And uh, so, but Square does take like uh, one to two business days to transfer payments to your accounts. So if you want an, an immediate transfer, that that comes at an additional fee of a uh, one point five percent so i mean they'll take care of you but they'll charge you for it though yeah so overall overall this is a great tool it's a very secure i mean square is a uh, is a major company okay they are they, they are one of the players in the industry they offer many 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 things it's not just uh it's not just the pos here so it is a very safe company it is a legit company it uh, actually uh, square is also payment card industry data security standards so they are pci compliance and uh, the company's products do not save payment card data all data is kept on the vendor server in encrypted form additionally a customer's full credit card number is never displayed even to the seller so this is really great you know when we talk about privacy this is just fantastic so overall we would recommend square whether you are in the restaurant industry, you are in the retail industry, or you are a small business, you will love it. I mean, if you are like the best, if you are a big company, you're not going to a, like like Square that much. But if you are small to mid-sized businesses, if you are there, yeah, if you are a small to mid-sized business, you will love it. And the POS tab is Android. The software tab is Cloud SaaS, and there is a free trial. So this is really fantastic. <laughs> Thank you so much for your attention i really appreciate it. in today's conversation i just talked to you talked to you about square pos i gave you the overview and uh, the added value the extras the rivals the pricing the features and then the verdict thank you god bless you i'll speak to you another time but until then remember stay marvelous <laughs>